guys and welcome to my channel. You're on Honestly Hazel. My name is Hazel, obviously. Um, today I'm gonna do a quick get ready with me. It's it's spring. I think it's time to you know you know make ourselves feel good. Everyone that's sitting at home during this quarantine, it's a little bit boring. Um, you know, people are just getting dressed up to go where your living room. So if you're gonna go to the living room, why not dress up a little bit, right? So today I'm gonna do a get ready with me. And if you're interested, please keep watching. So first off, I'm gonna start off with my primer. I'm gonna use the Infallible Mattifying Base um, from L'Oreal. And I'm just gonna use that to prime my skin. So guys, my name is Hazel. As I said before, I'm 30. How old am I? I'm 30. You know what it is? <laughs> it's my birthday month. It's my birthday in about a week. So I'm kind of like, oh, am I 30? I'm 30 going on 31. I'm looking forward to my birthday, but at the same time, I'm a little bit pooped, if I'm honest with you. So this coronavirus that's going around, honestly, it's it's a bit scary. It's scary times. Everyone's having to stay home. There's lockdown, um, you know, because obviously people are spreading this virus that you really can't see. And... Um, Honestly, for everybody's social lives, it's just dead. Like, this virus has killed 2020. 2020 was meant to be a whole new decade. Everyone's like, yeah, 2020 festivals, you know? I mean, I probably wasn't gonna go, but, you know, 2020 was meant to be my year, you know? It's my birthday. Yeah, I was supposed to go to Orlando and we had to cancel the holiday because of this virus. Yeah, I was not happy at all. So, I'm gonna stay home today look after myself and you know what even if I am going to the garden I'm gonna look hot I'm gonna use my foundation the foundation I'm using is Fenty honestly this is my favorite this is the Fenty Pro Filter foundation and I'm wearing shade 440 I was actually wearing 450 for a long time that was just after I was pregnant with my twins for some reason pregnancy just made my skin a lot darker so I was wearing that for a while, but then after that started to lighten up, I realized, hey girl, you know, girl, girl, it was too dark. So now, honestly, 440 is my favorite shade. So I'm gonna go through and apply my foundation. I like to just make sure that I go down to at least a level to blend my face in with my neck. So I love this Fenty foundation because you can actually apply several layers to it. And then it just covers up some of the dark marks, some of the dark spots that you might have. And it just gives it a nice, even tone. Okay, I like it. That's my foundation done. Next, I'm gonna go on to my eyebrows. This is a tip for you guys, right? This eyebrow pencil, this is a, this is like a typical drugstore pencil. I actually got this from the hair shop for one pound, one pound, and it is amazing. It helps having your eyebrows shaped beforehand, but these days, you can kind of draw, you can use concealer to finish the shapes. I love it's actually the NYX eyebrow gel and this is in color black noir this is so hard to find honestly I bought it from super drugs but it is hard to find but it is amazing and it lasts so long all you need is a little bit you just use it in moderation and it's it's beautiful it just darkens the eyebrows adds a little bit of depth to it um, I just honestly I just love it You'll see what I mean anyway. Look at it, look at it, look at it. Another thing you'll, you'll learn about me is I'm actually a nurse and I just worked a night shift. But you know, we move, we move. It's a little bit hard obviously with, with everyone staying at home, they're social isolating. And then I'm like, okay, some days I'm gonna be at home with my family and then other days I have to be at work, you know, because I'm looking after people. So it's a little bit like, okay, what do I, what do I wanna do today? 
but it's just about keeping yourself safe, keeping yourself healthy. How have you guys been coping with um, staying at home? If you check out my blog, I've actually written a couple of self-care tips, things for you guys to do at home whilst you're in quarantine. It'd be super helpful. Check out honestlyhazel.com and on the website you can read a whole list of things that I think would be quite fun to do at home, things that will keep you distracted, things that will look after your mental health, keep you sane whilst you're at home with family and um, you know, it just gives you something to do. I think a lot of people are really struggling with this, this lack of social communication and um, you know, being at home. Some people are at home alone, but you know, we'll get there, we'll survive guys. This is Pro Conceal from LA Girl and it's in colour chestnut. So now that my eyebrows are done, I'm going to go in with some under eye concealer. I'm going to use the same LA Girl Pro Concealer, but I, and again, I'm going to use Chestnut. I'm using this because I feel like this is very similar to my foundation shade and I don't want to be too light. Again, it's really up to you what kind of look you're going for. If you're going for BAM, you know, use a lighter shade if you want. If you're going for more of a neutral gap glam, you know, just an everyday look, then maybe look, go for a concealer that's slightly closer to your foundation shape. And I'm just gonna go for sort of a, a light touch. As I said, I'm trying to go for just a, a natural spring look. Right, so this is how I do my makeup. Sometimes I might add just a little V and if you go down the nose, that creates a little bit of definition. For me, this is my simple, neutral look. This is my NARS concealer and it's shade Amande. I haven't actually used it for a while, but I'm gonna just add a little bit, just to brighten up the eyes a little bit, just to make it pop. I'm gonna now set my concealer and um, there's a lot of setting powders out there um, you know you've got quite a few brands I know Rihanna has got one with Fenty there's you know Sasha there's a there's a lot there's you know black opal for example but I'm using today my Laura Mercier honestly this is like the best thing since sliced bread and I use this every day no no try to set my under eyes I'm just gonna go now and do my eyeshadow I, I love this eyeshadow palette this red is just so nice and warm and bright but at the same time it's it's not very overpowering I just yeah it's really nice cutesy now I'm gonna do my uh, contour I love this sleek contour palette but I'm gonna go in with the two darkest shades I think that's for my skin tone it just works really well this contour palette is actually cream based um, I think depending on your skin type decide whether you want to use a cream contour or a powder contour so then I'm gonna set my contour and to set that I'm gonna use my sleek palette again the contour but this is the powder one and with the same powder I'm gonna use this to contour my nose so now I'm gonna blend out my setting powder and I'm gonna use my MAC mineralized finish powder in dark deepest and I'm just gonna use that under the eyes again, just to, I'm just gonna use my um, powder brush.
guys for watching my video. Uh, that was just a quick chit chat, get ready with me, spring edition. Um, I hope you enjoyed how I do my makeup, um, but I would love to hear how you guys do yours, what products do you use? Please drop them in the comments below. Um, but obviously most importantly, please, if you did enjoy the video, please like, uh, don't forget to share and subscribe. All the products that I use, I will be listing them below in the description box. Um, so please check them out and don't forget to check out my blog at honestlyhazel.com. Bye guys.